in geomorphology we study different processes its sculpturing landforms like endogenic and exogenic and simultaneously we study erosional and depositional landforms developed by those processes thus all the erosional and depositional landforms need to be classified here they have been classified and on the basis of their classification a game also has been devised so on this board if you see here processes are given in vertical column and in horizontal in row the landforms means erosional landforms and depositional landforms have been written they have been discussed in detail while studying the processes and landforms for example when we were studying fluvial process and landform we observed all the erosional landform from river source to its mouth from river source first landform rill then gully rivulet ravine i shaped valley gorge canyon v shaped valley waterfall plunge pool rapid cataract elbow hogback cuesta eight structural benches river terraces pothole meander neck neck point and meander thus these are written in sequence from the source of river to the last erosional landfall and in this box all the depositional landforms by fluvial process have been given in sequence the depositional landform starts with alluvial fan and ends to delta deposition so this shows that we can learn these landform for two purposes one for prelim purpose and second for mains purpose for prelim purpose sometimes question is given that rill is which type of landform so there is a blank box and you have to put rill here in this box and in the fluvial process likewise if delta is given then you will put that slip in this box at the last in mains there may be question of two type number 1 discuss the erosional landforms by fluvial process in sequence so for maintaining sequence you will start from rill and end here at the neck point and meander but if question is different means discuss all the fluvial depositional landforms in sequence then you will start from this to this these are arranged in sequence sometimes question is of vast nature for example discuss all the erosional landforms and depositional landforms by fluvial process in sequence then you will start discussing writing elaborating from rill up to last delta likewise this is eolian process or wind process which erodes these landforms these are erosional landform written in sequence starting from inselberg to here blow out likely here this is this box contains all the depositional landforms by eolian process and these are given in sequence starting from sand dune to bird line there may be also objective type questions and there may be mains questions of three type number 1 discuss erosional landform by eolian process in sequence discuss depositional landforms by eolian process in sequence but sometimes discuss all the erosional and depositional landforms in sequence means you will start from inselberg to bird land in sequence by the eolian process after studying fluvial and eolian landforms let us now come to marine processes and erosional and depositional landforms 
एंड ग्लेशियल प्रोसेसेस एंड इरोजनल एंड डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म बाय देम द मरीन प्रोसेसेस एंड इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स आर गिवन हियर इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स स्टार्ट फ्रॉम क्रीक एंड एन टू प्रोमोटरी दीज आर अरेंज इन ए सीक्वेंस सो इफ देर इज क्वेश्चन दैट डिस्कस ऑल द इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाय मरीन प्रोसेस इन सीक्वेंस देन यू विल डू दिस बॉक्स बट इफ क्वेश्चन इज दैट डिस्कस द डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाय मरीन प्रोसेस देन यू विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम आप शोर एंड यू विल एंड एट डम्बेल एंड इट इज ऑल्सो अरेंज इन सीक्वेंस बट इफ क्वेश्चन इज दैट डिस्कस ऑल द इरोजनल एंड डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म बाई मेरीन प्रोसेस देन यू विल टेक बोथ द बॉक्सेस इन कंसिड्रेशन लाइक वाइज ग्लेशियल प्रोसेस इज दिस इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स आर गिवेन इन दिस बॉक्स विच स्टार्ट फ्राम स्नाउट एंड एंड टू फ्यूड एंड दीज हैव ऑल्सो बीन अरेंज इन ए प्रॉपर सीक्वेंस दैट्स वाई इफ क्वेश्चन इज दैट डिस्कस द इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाई ग्लेशियल प्रोसेज इन सीक्वेंस देन यू विल कवर दिस बॉक्स बट दीज आर द डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाई ग्लेशियल प्रोसेस विच स्टार्ट फ्राम मोरेंस एंड एन टू आउट वॉस प्लेन दीज आर ऑल्सो इन सीक्वेंस बट इफ क्वेश्चन इज दैट डिस्कस ऑल द इरोजनल एंड डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाय ग्लेशियल प्रोसेस देन यू विल टेक अप बोथ द बॉक्सेस नाउ लेट अस स्टडी अदर प्रोसेसेस एंड इरोजनल डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म्स डिप्लोड बाय देम नेक्स्ट प्रोसेस इज पेरी ग्लेशियल रीजन एंड प्रोसेस द इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स ऑफ विच स्टार्ट फ्रॉम निवेशन हालो अप टू पिंगो दीज आर द इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स विच हैव विच हैव बीन अरेंज इन ए प्रॉपर सीक्वेंस दैट्स वाई इफ क्वेश्चन इज दे आर दैट डिस्कस ऑल द इरोजनल लैंड फॉर्म्स इन सीक्वेंस बाय पेरी ग्लेशियल प्रोसेस देन यू विल टेक अप दिस बॉक्स हियर इन दिस बॉक्स डिपोजिशनल लैंड फॉर्म्स बाई पेरी ग्लेशियल प्रोसेस has been given in sequence which starts from black field to boulder field so if there is complete question that discuss all the original and depositional land forms in sequence by periglacial process then you will take up both the boxes likewise karst process also develops original land forms which are given in this box starting from solution hole to cave and the depositional land forms have been given here in sequence from stalactite to cave pillars if question is composite means all the original and depositional land forms by karst process in karst region then you will take up both the boxes at last actually this is semi arid process and original land form pediment and depositional land form bazaar and playa virtually these land forms are in semi arid region but these are eroded and deposited by the fluvial process so this belongs to sometimes arid area and sometimes in semi arid area but the question on this may be that discuss all the land forms means original and depositional both in a semi arid region which are made up by the fluvial process we have independently studied different means six process and erosional and depositional land forms in sequence with reference to the processes and those have also been classified and arranged in proper sequence according to the erosional land forms and depositional land form with the topic of land form classification it was also mentioned that it is land farm game so in free time or at your home with three or four of your friends you can play this game which will help 
you in prelim examinations as well as mains examinations game is you first draw this chart you first draw this grid on your page or chart and here in vertical column you mention fluvial process eolian process marine glacial periglacial and karst processes here there is a block or box of erosional landforms then depositional landforms likewise all these and now you take and now you get prepared the name sticks name sticks of this shape and suppose in name stick means you have written cave cave is a topographical landform developed by which process and it falls in which category you should first learn this then you can play this game and here this is cave so you decide in which box it should be put properly cave is the result of fluvial process or glacial process or karst process so certainly this cave is the result of karst process in karst it is erosional or it is depositional certainly cave is erosional then your third decision should be because here a number of erosional land forms were written in sequence so you put this cave at a place where it is permanent fix it need not replacement so this cave will be put in beginning or in the middle part or at end certainly cave is here put here at the end part and its study is called speleology likewise you take the second name slip it is loess now you decide which process gives birth to loess certainly it is the result of eolian process then it will be somewhere here in eolian process whether this is the result of erosion or this is result of deposition certainly this is the result of deposition in deposition you will put in the beginning where sand dunes are formed or you will put it at end where the eolian process comes to an end and semi arid or fluvial process starts so you will put it at a proper place so that it needs not replacement so better you put it here at proper place so that if there is a sand dune name slip you will put that here now next is this rill rill now you tell rill is the land formed by which process certainly by the fluvial process by fluvial it is erosional or depositional certainly erosional in erosional you will put in the beginning or in the end or in middle it will be put in the beginning rill gully erosion that we have studied and learned likewise you will continue this game of land farm next is tars tars is by which process certainly it is by periglacial process in periglacial region whether it is in erosional category or depositional so it is in depositional category in the beginning or end or middle nearly in the middle and end this will be tars so this way there are as far i have counted more than 98 land forms of erosional and depositional nature by these six process so you will prepare name sticks and you will draw this chart and put there respectively these so that your prelim purpose is served as well as we have discussed in mains you succeed and if it is in sequence then commission upsc will be satisfied so in free time you will 
enjoy playing this geomorphological landfall game.